Bitcoin mining Paraguay. A lot of people have been asking me questions. So here's the deal. What we do is we sell the Bitcoin mining machines to retail customers and we place it in host facilities. And Paraguay has some of the cheapest energy in the world due to having the second largest hydroelectric dam in the world. And it's, you know, Bitcoin friendly. There's mining facilities all over the country. And I think it will be the Bitcoin mining capital of the world pretty soon when regulations and electricity costs, you know, drive people mining in the U.S. out of business. So I just got off the phone with my friend who is mining with Compass, which is a hosting company in the U.S. He pretty much all but said they were a scam. Um, they keep turning the machines off. They're moving them to different locations. They're inactive. And the cost is just too high of what they have to charge customers. They just can't mine at a profit. Where in Paraguay, I mean, the energy cost at wholesale is like five cents a kilowatt hour. Um, and with Bitcoin machines, you need at least, you know, like a hundred terahash to be mining at a profit. So when you see these super cheap machines and they're under a hundred, that's because those machines are losing money and aren't being used right now. So that's why they are extremely cheap. We only sell in stock machines. We don't import from China. We buy in the country. We test it on the spot and then we place it. The Bitmain machines, the ant miners we get, we give a one year warranty on these machines. There will be a fee when we have to go to the facility, pull it and take it to the shop, but it will be minimal. And right now is just a great time to get in the mining because you can get the machines very cheap right now. And a little bit of over a year, we'll pay back these machines and they can run seven to eight years if they are maintained properly. Now, the price of the machine goes up with the price of Bitcoin. So if you can lock in the machines now before the next bull market, these machines are actually going to appreciate in the short to midterm. Obviously, their machines, they depreciate over time. But a lot of these machines were going for $8,500 and now you can get them for $2,200. So the prices of the machine can also appreciate and you can mine Bitcoin. And in the future with exchanges being shut down, going out of business, to be able to have access to Bitcoin going straight to you and you don't have to use an exchange and no one can stop you, it's kind of, it's a big deal. And I think if you're a true Bitcoiner, you want access to Bitcoin and no one can stop you. And it's virgin Bitcoin. It's never been transacted in. Um, so it's never been on the public ledger of who sent it. So it's pretty much, you know, untraceable virgin Bitcoin. So follow me, the Bitcoin capitalist. If you're interested in this, I have a link in the bio and I'm going to be putting a lot of this in the newsletter when I get back. Just been on the road and haven't had a lot of time to send out um, emails lately. So check it out.